Hi, this is Chris Gould with Geeks on Tour and Learn Google Photos. And I want to show you that now, as of October 2020, there are some changes in the editing features on the Android. So I'm going to open up Google Photos and bring up some photos and just go through some of the changes. So I'm going to open up this photo. It looks awfully dark, doesn't it? You tap on, you open the photo. Now the editing button still looks the same, but once we tap it, things will look different. The first thing that comes up is called suggestions, and this may be all you ever need. Tap enhance, and the picture is 100% improved. But it also offers, well, check it out. See if you like it warmer. Hmm, maybe I do. Or cooler. No, nope. I either like warm or enhanced. And notice that when you tap one, the other one goes away. This is enhanced. If I just tap it again, it's back to normal. Tap it once, it's on. Tap it again, and it's off. Tap it once, it's on. Tap another one, and that is on, and the first one is off, etc., etc. So pay attention to whenever you see the blue, it means that feature is in use. I think I do like the warm the best. And then I tap Save. And it offers to save a copy or save one file. I just want the one. I can always undo later. Let's look at the next picture. Edit. Once again, I would just try and enhance. That picture is much better. But notice the other two options that are given to me. It's not warm and cool anymore. Because this picture has faces, it offers me black and white portrait. It also offers me color pop, which means the people stay in color and the background is black and white. This will not be offered to you on all phones. You must have one of the higher end phones. I go back to enhance. I like that the best and save. And I'll just save once again. Back out. What does this picture need? It needs a crop. Tap the edit button. Now what you need to realize is there's lots more along this horizontal bar. So everything in the new editing features is horizontal. And I can either, notice how suggestions is highlighted, I can either drag over until crop is highlighted, or if I see it, I can just tap on crop. And now I just drag the corners, like always. And I like that, I tap save. Let's look at the next picture. This one is crooked. Edit button. And now crop and rotate still works the same, but it doesn't say rotate. So you need to know that you still go into the crop. And this zero point here is what you can drag to get the horizon straight. And now I want to go over to suggestions and do an enhance again. And I think I'll make that one cooler. All right save and save. Now here's an interesting one. Edit button. Enhance. Enhance makes our faces lighter but it kind of lightened the background too so I don't I don't like that. I just want to get rid of the shadows. I want to brighten the shadows. Now that's an adjustment so I have to scroll over until I see adjustment. Now I have brightness and once again just brightness all by itself is going to brighten the whole picture. But if you keep going over to the right and I'll turn that off. You keep going over to the right and I get shadows. And if I just want to brighten the shadows I make that number bigger. So see how it's only brightening the shadows. It's not changing the sky in the background. And I think I still want a little pop, so I'll go all the way over to the right and pop. Ah, much nicer. Done. So you're getting the idea. First of all, there are one, two, three, four, five pieces down at the bottom, five options. Suggestions, crop, adjust, 
filters, and more. And for each option at the first level, there are another row of options above. So just start playing with all of them and see what they do.